This video shows how to update the firmware on the ORSR reader. In addition to the reader, you will need a computer with a web browser, a terminal emulator such as HyperTerminal or CoolTerm, and a USB to serial cable. Updates cannot be done over the wireless Bluetooth link. Go to OregonRFID.com and select the Software and Manuals item from the Resources menu. Select the firmware for the ORSR reader. When the file appears, select all the data and then copy it. Switch to the terminal emulator and type FW and answer Y. Then paste the firmware. The file is loaded into the reader. Then the checksums are verified to make sure the transfer has no errors. And you're done. If you get a no firmware message, make sure you selected the ORSR firmware. You can also press the reset button with the reader power off to reset the reader. If you get the checksum error message, make sure you're not using the terminal emulator PuTTY. You can also press the reset button with the reader power off to reset the reader. The reset button is located on the main board inside the ORSR reader. If you have problems, contact us at support at OregonRFID.com. We have an extensive FAQ on our help desk. We can also schedule Zoom sessions to assist you. Our YouTube channel has some helpful videos. And we offer classes and webinars upon request. Thank you for your attention.